Hello all, D-Wingman97 here, and it's Jurassic Land. It's a daily shipyard review. It's a ship one. This looks awfully like a box ship, which is not allowed, but let's take a look. It's a landing craft. Oh, what do we have here? Okay, maybe not as boxy, because there's like an actual reason for it, as opposed to just being a cheaty butt. Alright, um, first things first, that needs to be one block off the ground, it cannot touch any of your ship, and it needs to be suspended, god, cobwebs are annoying, it needs to be suspended by glass, that way it's not touching, button, there's a button, what is this, an engine of sorts, alright, let's see here, gas, two, gas, two, gas, two, gas, two, lots of gas, all right. Should really watch my uh, wonderful what do you gonna call it? Shipyard signs tutorial on engines. If you put a few diesels on there, or maybe a boiler and a few gas, you'll uh, have a wonderful time and you'll go a lot faster. Not a bad view out the back. UDL landing craft detector radar, radio and nav. Okay, all the essentials there. Snazzy. And what block is that? That is called bricks. You are not allowed to build with bricks, senor. If you do warp Dave, just kidding, what is it? Warp, we'll just do this, MVS, right? You go over here, you go look for bricks, i.e. on the band side. Why they're not here, I don't know. Hmm, are bricks allowed? I guess they're allowed. Never mind. Mwahaha. I stand corrected. I don't remember using bricks or them ever being allowed, so that's what I was going off of. That blue is very bright. Alright, UDL, or a UD light tank. Radio, very nice. When landed, break down the ramp and place the block so tank can roll over. Snazzy tank. Oh yeah, those engines are plenty for this tank. Very nice. I like it. I always like landing crafts. I wish they were easier to use on Naval Battlezone, because unfortunately they are not so easy. But very well. Thank you all for watching. Like, subscribe, and comment, and I will see you all later.